Yeah, we back again. Bigger play. It's a nice Friday. And I had to deal with the women that advocate for the men. We got to give them props because since I've been doing the pod on the low, I'm always low key though. It be women that be advocating for us. And I be like, all right, little mama, we, we, we tapping in. So we, I'm going to start it like often. I'm going to just be dropping little gems about the women that be advocating for us. Like, it's, it's a lady, uh, the Sadia Psychology. Look, she be on there like, with some profound topics, like stuff that people don't want to talk about. She had one of them when she was speaking on our men designed to be faithful. I'm like, now we go back and forth because everybody want to have this equal thing and men it. No, but it's double standards. No, the reality is if I said people let me like, it just ain't practical for a man to meet you. 23, 30, 40. And God bless y'all with years together. So for the next 40, 50 years, he just gonna be practically perfect by you. He's gonna be with you. He ain't gonna never step. It ain't practical. Now, if I say it, it sound crazy. Now, when a young lady put her perspective on it, the severe psychology, everybody like, okay. And it's sad that. A, a man could talk to a woman and a woman could feel like, no, I'm not in agreement with that. But a woman can say it and she might be willing to accept that or listen to that. Or y'all going to call these girls what? Y'all know what y'all going to call them. What y'all going to call them? She'll pick me. <laughs> y'all going to be like, she'll pick me because just because... She advocating for the men. And 99.99999% of them be married. Advocating. I'm talking about advocating for us the right way. I'm talking about the energy right. She be, she got, let me see, she'll talk to the men about how you can tell if a woman really love you, how you can tell if the woman into you, how you can tell if the woman really got your back, how you can tell if she interested, how you can tell if she think you a simp. Just advocating for the men like a hundred percent. You know what I'm saying? She, she talk about things like should a masculine man provide for a woman? Should a masculine man provide for a feminine woman? Should a masculine man provide for a masculine woman? Look, she be, bro, what? What's the woman role if the man is the sole provider? Like, she be going in on behalf of the men. So, I'm going to be honest. Need to tap in with her because she's been official since day one. Always been official. So, we're going we gonna to have to talk about a few of them that be advocating for the men. So, I suggest you uh tap on in. Put that. I just put a pitch in her at right there. So, hey. Get with it or get lost. Deep red wheels, call it barbecue sauce. <laughs> All right, here go, here go another one. Uh, Melanie Monaco, right? Now, it's crazy, but the people, she'll pick me. She got, she had the show, the lemonade show, off the chain. She had a woman come on. She don't like, you don't like the guy. We like lemonade, but she beautiful. And guess what, though? Guess what, though? While you're capping, while you're playing, she just got married to somebody that's real special. I'm going to let you go and do your own due diligence on researching who this young lady is. She got her a big rock. But y'all going to call her pick me. Mm, mm, mm. She did one uh, for uh, the biggest lies that women tell themselves. So she come through and hold women accountable. Like, you ain't that. <laughs> now, if I come through, they mad at me. I'm this. I'm that. I'm, I'm misogynist. A non-sustentic. Men can't. We sassy because men talking. Bro, the whole world talking. And we giving value and knowledge and giving man perspective because I know they trying to erase masculinity. But it's young ladies like Melanie, Melanie, 
Melly Monaco. That's her name. Melly Monaco. I can't. I'm trying to make sure I get the names right. So I don't be messing up the name because I don't want nobody messing up my name. The bigger play. You did. It's rather rubber meets the road and we get straight to it. We get straight to it. But yeah, she advocate for the men and hold women accountable. They chill pick me. No, she got Joe. Hey. That rock bigger than any rock you ever going. Now look. So I'm it's this for them today, cause they advocating for us, putting us out there like yo, how's you sitting over here not holding yourself accountable and here Melly Monaco holding y'all accountable. I mean a beautiful queen who got her a beautiful ring. <laughs> a beautiful the queen with a beautiful ring is advocating for us. Yes, 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 she is. Yes, she is. Four lies that women tell themselves. She goes in. She holds the woman accountable. So, again, fellas, ladies, if you want to learn, if you want to have uh, uh, somebody that's giving you a positive influence and giving you a different perspective on how you should look at the men, you want to tap in the Melly. Because Melly got it. She got it. I ain't saying you're going to get the same results, but if you pay attention and let her mentor you, then maybe, you know, I'm giving y'all some, y'all might not know, but I'm giving y'all some gems. They advocating for us. That's that she said that I didn't. You know, I'm, all right now, now, uh-oh. So, here go, look, here go another one. Say what she wants. Says what she wants. This, this, this another young lady that be, Holding them accountable. We love her. She look, says what she wants. She lets y'all know. She got one. I be reading her post all the time. It's like a woman that does not submit is not ready for a relationship. The end. See, she say stuff like that. And I know y'all ain't gonna like it. But tap into her, another beautiful young lady that advocates for the men. She actually put it out there like I'm the number one male. Ooh, I love them when I see their energy. So I try to put out the truth and put out the emphasis on where a lot of the issues be and how delusional a lot of people may be. And we got a lot of we get a lot of lot of backlash because all I'm doing is watching with you. There's no reason to backlash me. But you do. And I'm all right with it because I ain't doing nothing. I'm just sitting here looking at it like how you looking at it. But every so often, more so now, I pop up, say, say, she says what she wants, she pop up, I'm like, man, what she saying? She drop all type of gems, and she drop them. She say that, not me. But I'm reading because I be in absolute agreement. And the women, that's the real deep women that really get it, they be real in tune with they self, in tune with they heritage. Heritage, and those are the ones people be like, you, I, they can't have them in even with these ladies that I'm putting up. Yes, they can. They just they feminine like that. They 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 understandable like that. They non confrontational like that. They uh they keep their energy right. They friendly, cooperative. I didn't I didn't had not all of them. I love to have a conversation with everybody, but you can't have a conversation with everybody in the world. It's just, it's just so many that advocate for us that you don't know about, but. We have we go back and forth with the little emails or the little comments and things of that nature. And then eventually you'll see us working together on something or having a conversation on something because it's not a difficult. It ain't all. It ain't none of that. They they I be reading just be listening to them like look at this how I be I be like oh okay <laughs> I just be what I just be chilling looking and listening but it's a lot of them so. I'm going to be dropping episodes to where I'm just highlighting the young lady that's advocating for the young men, the young lady that's advocating for the young women in a positive way, where it ain't all this back and forth, we are and we fight. No, we, it's, it's, it's us working together, and yeah, we understand where them guys coming from. No, we ain't got to sit up and go in on them. Yes, young lady, if you do this, you liable to get different results. Yes, young lady, if you do this, you liable to get different outcomes. Now, they hold us accountable, too. But for the most part, they coming from trying to help the young ladies understand that, hey, 
Maybe if you change your perspective, you'll get different results. It is what it is. So we're going to give it up to her. Got to highlight it. Says what she wants. Period. At her, that's her ad. You can go follow it on all platforms. Go follow them ladies on all platforms. They balanced out, turned up, beautiful. All right? Now, now this is the last one. We're going to do one more. Now, I, I can't cohere ca life. I be hard with these names, you know what I'm saying? Because the names be a little different. But she also, she's talk, she she helps hold a man accountable when she tell you what a real man look like. Like she got one I was reading. It said, a real protector protects you from himself before anything else. Meaning, he going to step up to the plate to be like, hold on. I'm a, I'm a real man, so... Before I introduce you or before I let you feel where I'm coming from with my flaws, I'm going to make sure I do what I can to protect you from even my flaws. Now, that's a stand-up guy. She keep it a thousand, too. It's, it's another one. It's, it's a plethora of them. I'm, a, I'm probably going to be doing an episode often highlighting the women that advocate for us so that the people out there won't just think because... I'm advocating for the men, trying to get the men to step it up in certain ways. And then I'm presenting the light to what a delusion that. So a person could possibly see how they looking in front of this camera, seeing oh, it really don't, it really don't add up. You know what I'm saying? It really, it just really don't. It don't make sense. And when you see yourself, you might be able to take a look at that and be like, oh, okay. I see why I was, I see why I don't, I don't look right at. So we just trying to put a highlight on that. But she's giving another advocate holding the women accountable and letting you know what a real man look like. These are all grown women, balanced women, beautiful women, perspective based women. They ain't coming with they and my emotions, opinions. I don't, that vibe don't come across from them period whatsoever. They coming with intellect. They coming with knowledge. They coming with experience. They coming with practical information to help facilitate good relationships between the counterparts, our counterparts, the man and the woman. That's what they doing. You looking for these results? I suggest Kahir Life. I suggest you follow Melanie. I suggest you follow Says What She... You got to follow them. You got to follow it. They going to give you some insight and give you a different perspective. Give you... How you looking at it different and you Liable to walk away with a ring. You want a ring or you really don't want a ring? You want some perspective? Because I be seeing a lot of people claiming and they popping it like they want that, but they ain't getting that. Say, why that want that? I just want to say I appreciate you, ladies. We got another round coming. We're going to keep them coming. Yeah. Bigger play. She said it, I did. All right.